Hello guys, um, Milkshake Man here, and I'm going to be doing a series of how I'm going to show you how to go to other parts of the city early in the game, because if you guys don't know, um, in the 3D, in the early, um, 3D GTA games, including GTA 4, you had to do missions in the storyline or to go to different places, but there are ways to get there. Now, I'll be doing one for each GTA game. So stay tuned for those ones, but I'll be doing Vice City Stories first since that's the game I'm playing. So first you want to, and this is, and um, this trick will allow you to go to the other island before doing the mission from Zero to Hero. That's the mission where you finally are able to unlock the full map. But um, and before that, until that mission, we're not able to go, we're only, we're only able to go here and here. We can't go here yet. So um, you want to be right here on the map and you'll find an, uh, a truck right here. You want to get in the truck, a Yankee, and you want to drive it over to Starfish Island. So that's the island connecting both, that's in between the two islands. By the way, these methods are without cheats, so no cheats. So this is a clean save game. The reason I have $10,000 is because um, it's, I explained it in my other um, video. So basically what you want to do is you want to park it up here, as you can see the gate's closed, because there's a hurricane warning in the game, um, and the bridges will not be opened until after doing the mission from Zero to Hero, as I explained. But um, there's a way to get there before doing the mission, so you want to park that right there, so that it's on a slope. So let me show you what it looks like, the slope. Basically you just want to get out of there, and as you can see it's right there, it's like that. You want the wheel down the back there and you want to park it right here you want to be as far as possible as you can without it falling in the water and then what you want to do is you want to jump on top of the truck and jump up on here it might take some time and there we go and basically what you want to do is, is you want to just run oh dang it we didn't do it we didn't do it we didn't do it right Ah, oh, dang it it sometimes does that it sometimes doesn't work and especially when I'm trying to play the game like this, it doesn't really work as well when I'm recording. When I record stuff, it's called the Gamer's Curse, if you've heard of it. It's basically where stuff doesn't go well while you're playing. Um, so we gotta swim all the way back up. I know a place where we can get back up, so... Right here is the spot, so let's swim up. Hmm. Truck should still be there. Yep, it's still there. Okay. Let's try this one more time. It's really hard. Um, but um jump back up. Ain't it didn't work that time. Hmm. And then I'm gonna jump up up here again. And um I want to make sure I'm part of this. So I'm going to try this one more time. There we go. So you want to make sure that you hit that slope right there. You want to make sure you hit that slope. And um, sometimes you might not make the slope and it'll just push you into the water, but it pushed us over there. So um, just walk.
And now we are on the second island early. As you can see. Um, when you know that, when you see that loading screen that says Welcome to Vice City, you know that you're on the other island. Because it's loading up the other side. But, um, yeah, that's how you get here, early. So if you want to pop the red balloons early, you want to get a helicopter or a boat early, and that's what you do. You can try to swim here, but it won't work. Because, number one, you don't have enough stamina. Number two, there's a bear, there's an invisible wall. Are you in the dump? Sorry Let's just about take this taxi. Um, you cannot save your game here, um, you can't. You can only save your game once you unlock a safe house over here, but that's for doing the missions and, and doing a mission walkthrough on it. But I will be doing how to get to set different islands in the game videos. So, um, you can go up here then. And here you'll find a sniper rifle and you'll find a helicopter. If you want to get back to the first island, you can just kill yourself, or you can fly back. Or drive a boat back, too. So, I'm going to show you for an example of how you can get back to the first island. I'll just kill myself. And I'll just drown myself, basically. You can also get out of the vehicle and swim, but I waste it, and then what will happen is is the loading screen will appear and um now we're back on the first island, so I wanted to show you guys a video on how to do that. Stay tuned for my more how to get to Stay tuned for the other videos on how to show you to get to other islands in the other GTA games.